Here we're going to look at squaring numbers close to a power of 10, starting with those which are just a little less than 10. So let's look at 8 squared. There's a subsutra here, a sub rule, it's, it's quite long, um, but it's uh, simple enough to follow. Whatever the extent of the deficiency, lessen it still further and set up the square of that deficiency. So here we've got 8 squared. We're going to relate this 8 to the base 10. The deficiency is 2. And we reduce 8 by 2, making 6. And then we put down the square of the deficiency. The deficiency is 2, square that is 4. Now we'll look at uh, base 100. So we've got 97, 90. No, 90, 94 squared. The deficiency is 6. And so we lessen 94 by 6, leaving 88. That's 94 take away 6 is 88. And then we put down the square of the deficiency. Uh, 6 squared is 36. It's another example. 97 squared. The deficiency is 3. So we take 3 off the 97, leaving 94, and then put down the square of 3, which is 0, 9. We have to remember that two digits are required uh, over on the right, and you can compare this with the method of Nicolum multiplication. If we have 97 times 97, in a previous session this was shown, the two deficiencies are 0, 3, we multiply these, making 0, 9, and then cross subtract in either direction, giving 94. So it's really a special case of Nicolum multiplication. And this can be extended to a a any power of uh, uh, 10, let's say we've got 9998 squared, the deficiency is 2, so we decrease it further. 996 and the base has four zeros in it. It's 10,000. So we need four digits over on the right and we square the deficiency uh, giving four. So 0, 0, 0, 4. Now when it comes to numbers which are above the base, like 13 squared, this time we're using a surplus. So instead of subtracting, we add. So we take the surplus 3 and add it on, making 16, and then put down the square of the surplus, 9. Another example, 108 squared. Here the surplus is 8, so we increase 108 by that, making 116, and then put down the uh, square of the surplus, which is 64. And this can be extended to um, any size you like. So we can write the answer straight down. Like so. And it's really based on an algebraic principle which is that if you have number x plus a all squared and you multiply out these brackets and simplify come to x squared plus 2ax plus a squared. And that 2 there shows why we uh, are adding on the, um, the surplus. And similarly, when numbers are below the base, we would have x squared minus 2ax plus a squared. And that is the algebraic explanation for this method.